Face off to the glove side of Jones. Gordon tied up at the circle. It's still loose. Puck goes to the point. Bernard Docker waiting, curling, firing. He scores! Jacob Bernard Docker. And this game is tied. Extra time waiting. Nobody comes to him. And it is a 4-4 tie. Right, Hoon Kim will clear the puck. It goes right to a Grizzly player where that's Bromeed, but Kinderchuk recovers. Looks for Hoon Kim off the boards for Kinderchuk. He'll float it there and a chance for Pasemko looking for Ergang. Three on two, Pasemko cross ice. Chance Bernard Docker scores! Jacob Bernard Docker opens the scoring to four to one on a great play by the Oilers. Tic-tac goal almost. And a nice pass by Zane Kendrachuk on that one. Missed the pass, comes back to Beers at the left point. Swings it over to his right along the blue line to Bernard Docker. Back to Beers in the high slot. Number six for the Oilers, shoots it on net, rebound is there, they score. Beers with the shot on Benson, made the save, rebound for Bernard Docker, cleans it up, 1-0 Okotoks. Yeah, and that's just, uh, you know, they move it around in that power play and it ends up that Mitch Benson, that puck comes to him, he can't contain the rebound. Wide open there as Bernard Docker uh, steps in. As he's back in the point, he throws it across, goes right to the net, and uh, Beers just lets the long wrister go and ends up that Mitch Benson uh, kicks the rebound out and Docker's able to get to that puck and, and pa tap her pass. But he never got a shot off. Sasana tied up on the far side with Doig, and it comes out to center ice. Here come the Oilers, shorthanded. Pasemko in the left circle. In front, Bernard Docker shoots, he scores. Third shorthanded goal against this season for Brooks. Jacob Bernard Docker joins the rush on a pass from Pasemko. And he beats Benson, low blocker side to make it 3-1 Okotoks with 2.28 left in the second. And the thing you want to avoid on your on your power play, especially guys up top, is is getting isolated. And Dennis Asani gets isolated, can't uh, win the puck battle, tries to throw back into the middle. And on the turnover, Bernard Docker jumps into the play. A nice cross ice pass. Goes right to Maine. He'll glove it down for Force, who keeps the play alive. He'll find Carpishin trying to get around Bernard Docker, but he can't. Here's Bernard Docker off the wall. Here's Wong trying to walk in. Austin Wong drop pass. Bernard Docker scores! Two straight games, two straight short handed goals by Jacob Bernard Docker, and it's 2 1 Oilers. Jacob Bernard Docker's on a different planet right now, the way he's been playing. Bernard Docker now has it, high slot, shoots a long one, wide left to the net, there was no one pressuring him, and back to the slot, Huber's wide open, had it poke free, Suk around to keep him, to Bernard Docker, right circle, no pressure on him, he shoots and scores! With 58 seconds to go in the first period, an effective power play for the Okotoks Oilers, with all the space in the world for one of the highest scoring players the last time these two teams met, allows him to walk to the right face off dot with nobody anywhere near him and fire one past Mitch Benson to make it one nothing. Yeah, uh, as Mashi goes out, completely collapsed, he walks right into the hash marks and uh, he let a guy like uh, Jacob Bernard Docker walk in like that and get a one-timer away. He's uh, He's going to pick a corner, and it's just a great snapper, a ton on it, and uh, one nothing hockey game here. Here's his clear-out attempt. is then forced the rest of the way down the ice by good work from Huber, the captain of the Oilers. Grizzlies in behind their own net of Felgaris checked by Laderud. He'll center it. Bernard Docker scores a shorthanded goal for the Okotoks Oilers with 48 seconds left in this Grizzlies power play as it was Laderud able to extend his point streak now up to six games with a shorthanded assist as he came in after the Grizzlies defense forced a turnover and sets it up and uh, Bernard Docker's shorthanded goal here extends the Okotoks lead uh, and it's a five on three again for Okotoks beer shot stopped by Sylvester rebound chance is stopped as well another chance they score the third chance, the Okotoks Oilers running up the score now here in Bonneville. Well, Six to two, and another five on free goal, Okotoks. It's iconic, just throws it in front of the net, Bernard Docker picks it up, and West will get out of their end. At center, puck is fired in, changes oh. underway, and scores! That came off the backboards, off the back of the goalie's leg, and into the net. We've seen and talked about the kind of bounces this rink can produce. 
Alexander was waiting for that puck to come out on his left so he could play it, and it hit him right in the back of the leg on the right and goes in. As Okotoks starts to break out, here's a chance for Holloway. Up the middle, Holloway leaves it for Huber. Quick shot, stop, rebound, goes into the corner. A penalty is coming up here against Camrose after Holloway drove to the net. Puck comes into the slot. Quick shot, Jacob Docker scores! Jacob Bernard Docker with a quick shot as he came in to pinch. But he'll give to Kyler Wall, he'll walk in, one-time chance, but our Docker shot goes right to Wong. He'll try to center, and now it is a five on three as Holloway returns from the penalty box. Here's Bernard Docker, 47 seconds with the five on three for the Oilers. Here's Bernard Docker. Now for Wall, in for Bernard Docker, waiting for Wong. Now a chance, Bernard Docker, one time, roll the shot, that's a rebound, Bernard Docker scores! Big rebound by Matthews, and... Docker goes five hole and he'll beat the Canuck goaltender. It's two nothing Okotoks as the Oilers able to cash in on the five on three. And here's a chance there, a shot that Joey May stopped off of Bassnet. Goes back to the point as Bernard Docker able to keep it alive. Now back to the point for Bernard Docker. His shot, he scores four to two Calgary after two periods of play. As there's a big check there. Ryan Stoinich eats the ice as Austin Wong taking his man down. And now Olsen gets it across, chance right off the bat, and they score! 20 seconds into the third period. Now Erdogan has the puck, trying to cut it next to the Erdogan through the forehand, and knocked away from Olsen, looks for a lane, back to the point for Beers. Cutting in, nice stick by the person, it rolls down to Bill, and Docker, he scores! That puck was still rolling, and Shuka Bernard Docker, Ties the game at two on his 13th of the season. Callis at the point trying to hold it. As that puck bounces around. And back come the Oilers. Bernard Docker with a break and he'll go on the backhand and score. Jacob Bernard Docker, a shorthanded goal. It's the 11th shorthanded goal for the Oilers this year. And Bernard Docker has his 15th of the season. Back for Kyler Wall, and he'll shoot it deep into Mustang territory. Racing after it will be Gib Cody. Is now Setaguchi can't handle the pass. Cody trying to center. He knocks his man down. No call as Doig has a look to the line. Here's Bernard Docker. Quick shot. They score! Jacob Bernard Docker and really had to bite on that one to get a shot off low on the glove side of Abel. And JBD makes it 5 to nothing. Keeping. Now for Wong, left circle. Down low, it's Gordon. Across, looking for a streaking Bernard Docker. Puck loose. Puck goes to the line. It's Blankenberg. Bernard Docker again, right circle. He walks to the point. Now swings for Olsen. Now for Bernard Docker. One timer, the drive. Scores! <laughs> Bernard Docker's got two, and it's a power play goal after Setaguchi stepped into Zane Kenrichuk. The puck sent back by McCarty, and now Bernard Docker. Looks for a lane as he'll do it himself and over the blue line. Bernard Dock with some room. Docker walking in. The chance he scores! Bernard Docker tried to look for a stretch pass a couple of times, but didn't really shake off his opponents, but was able to go in slowly and then picked up speed once he got past the Canuck blue line. When he has the chance, he'll drop for beers. Walks in. Sats up and creeps a little bit closer. Here's a chance for Bernard Docker. Now back for beers. Beers now for Gordon, back to Beers, one timer, slap pass, Bernard Docker scores! Two straight games, two straight two goal games for Jacob Bernard Docker. And a face off win by Huber, he'll chop it back to the point for Carson Beers. Goes to Bernard Docker, walks and has time. Bernard Docker trying to sneak it on the blocker side, hits his own man and he scores! As Jacob Bernard Docker will get credit, the Oilers score on the power play. Face off to the glove side of Griffin Bowerman. Huber in to take the draw uh, against Kupka. A face off win by the Oilers again. Very key on this power play. Be Bernard Docker oh. lights it. Scores! He grips it. He rips it. JBD makes it 2 1. Oilers. And a little bit of a delay allows Bowerman to kind of get caught a little bit and beats him on the low blocker side. Bernard Docker regains the Oiler lead. But he settled down the bouncer, got it mid blue line to Bernard Docker. Holds it, holds it, leaves it left side for Blankenberg, and he'll skate to the high slot, leave it there for Bernard Docker, 55 seconds to go, Bernard Docker shoots and scores! And 
the Oilers get help. They get a lot of help to wow. tie this one up 1-1. Wong dumps uh, Jacob LaPointe and uh, ends up that they get the shot. So, wow. That, uh, I, uh, that's hard to believe those aren't called. I mean, they're very obviously. Wong just skates in right behind uh, Jacob LaPointe here. We'll see it here. And just takes his feet right out and uh, ends up knocking him down. So... Then it, it's a shot and they score, so the bands have to be resilient here and uh, find a way to recover. And the Oilers have it starting up ice. Ladderud will tap it out to the red line. Ladderud carries in, dishes right side. Huber's wide open and shoot. It's blocked. Rebound. Bernard Tucker scores. An easy opening goal for Okotoks as no one covers the AJHL top defenseman in the slot. And Okotoks gets the opening goal just 45 seconds into game four. Absolutely no chance for Mitch Benson there as Jake Tice ends up on the four check right on top of him and he can't see it. And a guy like Bernard Docker on that three-way passing play is not going to miss. And Tice follows in. The rebound comes out right to Docker, and he picks that corner. A great shot. You know, if you're a forward going in there and you want to go on the wall and block that thing, uh, you may take it in the head. Yeah. Here's her gang left wing side for the Oilers. Carrying in. Flicked it back. Bernard Docker's wide open on the rush. He shoots. He scores! Nobody learns their lesson about leaving Jacob Bernard Docker wide open in the slot off the rush. Number 24 zings it home from the left hash marks. And Okotok strikes first in game six. It's one nothing for the visitors. That's a great shot by Bernard Docker as he joins the rush. And Ergain just draws it back to him. And Bernard Docker, he gets in. He gets right in on that ringette line. And he has such a good shot. Here's Austin Wong. He'll give to Olsen. Cuts in the 16-year-old, tied up, and he'll knock down Comrie hard. Here's Olsen, open across, Bernard Jocker, he shoots it, scores! That all starts with a hard check by Quinn Olsen. Bernard Jocker comes late, and with 1.56 left in the second period, GBT has the Oilers back on top. Kendrick Chuck in the corner, goes to... In the left circle, in the slot, back to the line. Jacob Bernard Docker sells the puck down. He walks in with time. He scores! Jacob Bernard Docker waits, walks in, and beats Nolan Kent on the high blocker side. Here's a long cross ice pass trying to settle down as Bernard Docker in the right corner. And now Gordon shoveling to Bernard Docker, and Saints will swarm, try to clear, but. Comes loose to Bernard Docker. Now it's Olsen waiting at the high point. Now for Bernard Docker. Keeps now wide. Sparks. He scores! Jacob Bernard Docker on the power play. Wait for traffic in front. And the Oilers open the scoring on the power play. In game five, it's 1-0.